Get ready, get set, let's go and make some balloon slime together. Good evening, it's Mrs. Markey, and you are here with my daughter, Lucia, and my other daughter, Fiona. Say hi. Hi. Say hi. Hi. So today we're going to be challenging ourselves with some DIY slime. And we actually found a recipe that we thought was pretty interesting, oh. and that is to create some balloon slime. So in order to create balloon slime, you need a few ingredients. Lou, do you want to say what the first ingredient is? What do you need first? School glue. Good, you need some school glue. We got a big one because Elmer's. we're gonna be making lots Elmer's. of different types Elmer's. of Elmer's glue. glue. My son came to join us as well. Say hi, Dom. Hi. Um, you also need some saline solution, um, some eye drop, uh, it's usually for contact lens solution um, that will help. And uh, we also need baking soda for this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Food coloring is optional. And you also, for this last part, you want to include a drinking straw. And the drinking straw is actually going to be to help blow up the slime because we're gonna actually be able to make it into a balloon. All right, stay tuned. We're gonna show you what to do next. Okay, okay Dom, what's the first step? Step one is to pour four or eight ounces. We are doing eight ounces because we're doing a large batch. The second step yeah. is to add food coloring. Go ahead. The next step is to mix it. So the last step after you mix the glue with the dye is you're going to need a solution of baking soda to contact lens solution. So you're going to need to have one teaspoon of baking soda mixed with five tablespoons of contact lens solution. So for us, we're doubling everything, so it'll be two teaspoons of baking soda, 10 tablespoons of contact lens solution. All right, stay tuned. All right, now we are at the point where we're going to start mixing the baking soda and saline, uh, the contact lens solution with the glue slowly and we're gonna start mixing it. I made this gigantic bubble because I poked the straw in the bottom. So it blew up and it got so big. Excellent, and you just used a straw, right? Yeah. So using the new bubble Buster. slime, because it's got the baking soda added to it, it creates a nice elasticity. So try it out. You just insert the straw inside, inside the actual slime and hold it, kind of you kind of hold around it like this. Um, there's a picture of it there for you to see and you can actually blow it up. Have fun with it. Mm -hmm. 